Unlike other West African countries, Niger's national police force implements different stages of the curfew enforcement. First comes raising awareness a few hours before the 7 p.m. cut-off time. We ask everyone to respect the curfew and to protect themselves and others. It is not too early to enforce the curfew at 7 p.m. And it is true that it starts at 7 p.m. But our officers will continue outreach on the ground until 8 p.m. to help citizens to get back to their homes. On pickup truck, officers patrol near maize arteries crowded with small traders. Here, they invite the population to return home before the curfew hour. Honestly, I think it's a little early to start curfew at 7 p.m. For me, it should start at 9 p.m. and end at 5 a.m. Lots of economic activities usually work very well between 7 p.m. and midnight. After raising awareness, the police start the control phase. The head of the security force gives final instructions before his team is deployed to the field. Those who refuse to comply are arrested in accordance with the procedures to be followed. It's not about beating people. If people are stubborn, they have to be disciplined and taken on board. More specifically, the process of arrestation starts at 8 p.m., but before 8 p.m., those who are still outside have to be escorted home. Overall, the curfew is respected in Niger's capital, even if it has a negative impact on some economic activities. Chom Gono, CGTN.